Today we have with us an eminent faculty in radiation oncology, Dr. Ramdas, who is the director, clinical and elite services, Karkinos Healthcare India, and the former additional director of Regional Cancer Center, Trivandrum. I welcome you, sir, to this fifth ISO MVR CanCon 2024. Thank you. So today, my question is, the systematic screening and early intervention in oral cavity cancers has shown to reduce the mortality. And how do you think we can implement a systematic and regular community oral cavity cancer screening in the country? See, the Regional Cancer Center Trivandrum, in collaboration with the WHO International Agency for Research on Cancer, has done a cluster randomized control trial in Trivandrum. Uh, it's a community-based program which was started in two, uh, 1996, completed in 2014. We conducted three rounds of screening using, uh, at an interval of three years, using oral visual examination as the method. Uh, oral visual examination is the most commonly tested oral cancer screening method, even though there are several other methods, but this is the only one which is widely tested. And this is the first randomized study in the world which has shown benefit of this method and reducing the mortality, death rate, by 34% after three rounds of screening. And this benefit is seen among those who use alcohol and tobacco. Those who are not habituated to this one, the benefit is not seen. And this was published. It, uh, we studied uh, more than 200,000 people, uh, 2 lakh people. They were enrolled into this study. And uh, 13 panjaits were included. And this first this thing was published in 2005. And considering the importance, because this is the only study which has shown this kind of reduction in mortality, identifying people in early stages and then treating them appropriately. So that was very, very interesting. And considering the importance of this one, Lancet is one of the major channels which has featured the findings of this study on the cover page in 2005. And after the publication of these things, several several countries got interested, especially countries where uh, low and middle income countries, especially Asian countries where the incidence of oral cancer is very high. They have started implementing oral cancer screening. This is a very simple method because oral cavity can, can be easily accessed. We can initialize the oral cavity use, uh, with a good torch and uh, identify abnormalities in the mouth test. If there is any uh, suspicious finding, we can biopsy it and then if found malignant, you can treat and which will, uh, we can identify them in early stages and by treating them, you can prevent death rate. That was very, very important. And if this is very simple test which can be easily implemented through our PHCs. In India, it is very easy. So only thing is we have to give training to doctors in identifying the pre-cancer lesions, which can be easily done. And for this, we have developed a digital atlas, or atlas, which is freely it is free of, it is available in the website, free of cost. So there are more than 400 pictures of oral lesions in it, and that can be used for training Doctors and nurses, there's no need for doctor to this, even nurses, because when we did the screening, we trained college educated youth in identifying the abnormalities. They could identify this lesion by getting a one month training. So that way, it is very easy to implement. So that kind of, using this kind of screening and implementing it through our health services, we can reduce the mortality from oral cancer. So the Kerala government has taken it up, not only oral, breast and cervix. Three so we are doing it in Kerala. It's part of our cancer control strategy and in in all India level also, they have taken it up to implement it in several states. 
Thank you, sir. Thank you for your vision and thank you for sharing your thoughts. Thank you.